to my channel and I feel like I have not done a hair video in forever but today I have a wig from Nadula Hair and I absolutely love the color of this um it's a color I have never tried before so I have my hair like somewhat braided down um, I'm gonna put this wig on with the lace so y'all can see what it looks like um, before I like install it and do all that stuff to it so yeah stay tuned before I have done anything to it um, it's very Beyonce like to me like this color is giving me Beyonce vibes but oh, he's right there um, I'm gonna get closer so you can see what the lace looks like all right so here is the lace on it and I have done nothing to it so you can see like my little baby hairs up there but this is it I have not plucked anything or done any of that I feel like the lace looks pretty good all right so this is what it looks like before I do anything to it um, I am going to install an elastic band on the inside because you guys know if you watch my videos I don't glue down my wigs so I'm gonna install an elastic band on the inside to secure it down and do all the baby hair stuff and I'll be back with the final look of it Okay, so I just put my elastic band in, so now I'm going to make some baby hairs to lay them down. Um, so this is what it looks like without doing any baby hairs or anything like that. Um, yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and make some baby hairs. hesitant at first because I have never had a color like this before um because I feel like the whole wig is basically just colored so I'm not used to that um but what I am going to do is I'm going to take this spray bottle and I'm going to spray it because the hair is super big um the curls are very beautiful and you can make it how big or however loose you will want them. Not big, big, loose or tight, however you would like it. But I do like to have definition in my curls, so that's why I'm spraying them. Um, usually I will wash the wig before, but I'm kind of short on time. So I had to do it this way, but as you can see, when you wet it, it's very nice. It looks darker because it's wet, of course, but if you wet it, the curls get very, very defined. And I am using a dimming brush, so this is my favorite brush to use to define curls and everything. So. Here's what it looks like when it's like wet and I have sprayed it and everything. I didn't put any product on it. Um, I'm probably not going to. I just want to see what it does without any product first. That's what I usually do with hair. So we're going to see how it looks. Um, I might get my diffuser and diffuse it so y'all can see what it looks like dry and defined but it's a lot of spraying going on and I love this Mr. Spray Bottle. You can get it at like any beauty supply store but it's one of my favorites so I'm just going to brush this side as well and see how it looks. I didn't really get the back as much it's all good. It looks so pretty, like, with the highlights and everything. I think it looks gorgeous. Alright, 
So I'm going to get my blow dryer and I'm going to diffuse it to make it dry and define the curls a little bit more. Okay, so I am going to use this diffuser um, blow dryer. It is from Bionic. I believe they have it at Sephora. But I'm going to go ahead and diffuse my hair with it. All right, you guys. So this is the final look of it. I did spray it and add some water and I diffused it. Um, and it's still a little wet, but sometimes when I diffuse my hair, I don't like it to be completely dry I like it to air dry so yeah so y'all I absolutely love this hair I was very very scared at first because I never had a color like this as I said before but I think the color looks really really good and I did get a tan so I feel like that kind of helped but I think this is a super pretty wig so I'm going to give you all the details of the wig. So it is from Nadula Hair, which is a company that I have tried before and absolutely love their products, their hair, um, their wigs and all that. Um, and inside I also got this cute little goodie bag and it came with an edge control brush, which is something that I always need. I have so many of them, but I just feel like the more the merrier. And then um, it came with a wig cap, which I don't use. I don't really glue down my wig. And then it came with some lashes and some earrings that are actually kind of cute. So yeah, I absolutely love it. Um, also, what I used to help install this wig was I did use the EBIN Tinted Lace Spray because I didn't bleach the knots on them. And I also use some edge control um, to lay down my baby. All right, so I'm gonna give you guys the specs on this hair. So this hair is Brazilian. It is a 13 by four lace honey blonde curly wig and 24 inches. Um, so I'm 5'3", and I'm gonna show y'all where it comes down on me. So it comes down like a little bit past my back. Um, so it's 24 inches. I absolutely love it, you guys. Like, this is so pretty. I'm going to turn around so you can see the back of it as well. I think this wig is so cute. I love the color of it. Um, I really didn't get much shedding. I did use my Dimmin brush and only a little bit of hair came out, but that's expected with curly hair because the curls intertwine and lock together sometimes. But overall, like I am loving this and this wig is not going anywhere. I did not even use glue to glue it down or anything like that. I just love it so much. I think I might start doing color because it's pretty, especially for the summertime. Like I'm loving this. But yeah, I'll leave everything like below in the info box and any coupons they have. Let me know what you think about this wig and I'll see you next time. Bye you guys.